Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial from the howtodolessons.com. Today I'm going to show you how to fix any DLL file error from your computer. So it's pretty basic, so I'm going to make it a short video. There's no need to make it a long one. So you need to do what you need to do to learn the DLL file that you're missing. You can find it pretty easily because the error is going to tell you which file you need. So then go answer dllfiles.com and just scroll down and find the search bar and type the name of the DLL file. In this case I'm gonna use this DLL file to show you now which is D3DX9 the 39 DLL. So I pressed enter. Now this side shows you an options to the easier ways maybe but I don't think so. You can use that ones but I'm gonna use the manual fix which is free and pretty easy. Now go press download zip file from here. Then again you're gonna find then it's gonna show you the options, the 64 bit and 32 bit. And you're gonna choose the one with system fit. Now my system is 64 bit, so I'm gonna press this one, I'm gonna press download it. So it starts downloading. I already have it so I'm not gonna wait for it. So after you download it, just extract the zip file and open the folder. There's a DLL file and there's a readme file which helps you have to fix that error but I'm gonna show I'm showing you anyway. So then you're gonna open your computer and then you're gonna enter the local disk with your system built in and then you're gonna go to Windows, then you're gonna scroll down to system32 file folder. So after you open that folder, you're gonna copy that uh, DLL file that you downloaded and then you're gonna paste it. That's it. That's it. Copy and replace if you don't have it. If you have it. So if you have a 32-bit system, that's it. You fix the error. You can go on. You you don't have to watch this video any longer. But if you have a 64-bit system like me, then you have to do one more step. You have to go to Windows File again, and instead of System32 file, you're gonna or enter this folder which is CYSWOW64 enter that folder and the same process copy the DLL file and paste it that's it and copy and replace anyway so if you did it now it's done you fix the DLL file that's it thank you for watching this video and if you have any requests from this site and any tutorials or anything just type it in on the comments below so have a nice day